Hey everybody, Navedoc5184 here and welcome to another music reaction. Today I'm reacting to Imagine by Pentatonix. So Imagine is probably one of my favorite songs, definitely one of my favorite John Lennon songs for sure. So um, with the covers I've seen Pentatonix do so far, they have been absolutely outstanding. So I'm really, um, I guess because I have high expectations for this though I'm sure they won't disappoint but either way um, we're just gonna go ahead and get started I'm very curious to see what they do with this I will leave a link to the original video in the description below and let's go ahead and get this started I love how they always work like the settings with their videos they always do such a good job with it Okay. Okay. It's easy if you try. No help below us. Above us only sky. Okay. Imagine all the people living. Okay, so I gotta say, I'm really digging um, the setting they got for this, you know, and, um, you know, I really wish I had words um, to really describe, you know, my thoughts and feelings right now. I mean, as always, their harmonies and vocals are always on point, so there's really no point in rehashing all those, though I'm probably going to, so you'll just have to forgive me for that, but, um, I mean, it's just the... The touch and feeling that they're putting with this song. I honestly like the fact that even originally the song is such a simple song. You know, it's like John Lennon piano and some strings. So I think it's a very easy song to adapt to acapella. But to really keep the feeling and emotion. Like with just the first part of it. And I gotta tell you, Avi, you know, I, I didn't know, like... Like, wow, I wouldn't exactly call that a high range. I don't think I was, like, really expecting him to you know, hit those so easy, so obviously very impressed with that, you know, and um, <laughs> let's just see where uh, they take us from here. I really like him too. definitely a song that's very suited for them but I'm not the only one, not the only one. I hope someday mm. you'll join us and the world will be as one y'all I really love what they're doing with this I mean the, the, the harm as, as I said in my last point, you know, it's like harmonies and vocals are always on point, but you know, just something just, I wish I could really pinpoint what it was that makes us feel even more special than the stuff that I've reacted to them before. But I mean, it's just add, it's adding a very, I don't know if emotional touch is the word I'm looking for. It's definitely adding a very, you know, I guess emotional is just the word I'm going to have to use because I can't think of any other appropriate word. If you guys can, please uh, comment below um, what you think that word is because I can't come up with anything right now. But I mean, the way they're doing their harmonies and even adding like the extra um, uh, vocals, you know, to it outside of what, you know, uh, John Lennon had, you know, it's just it's adding such a huge emotional you know feel to the song 
you know, I mean, the song itself, you know, I mean, anyone who's listening to the song, you know, understands, you know, it's like anybody who's always looking for like peace or oneness or anything, this is like their go-to song, you know, it's like, you know, so, and it's also very appropriate, I think, because you look at the group themselves, you know, and you look at, you know, how, you know, the, how mixed they are as a group, you know, and it's like, this is a very appropriate group, I believe, to do a song like this, you know, so maybe that's really what it is that's touching me, you know, I'm like subconsciously catching on the fact that, you know, it's such a mixed group singing a song, you know, about living in peace and living as one, you know, and it's a very appropriate song for them, I think. We'll be what we got going on here? I saw those little boards earlier. I knew they were going to play some sort of role in this. Let's see what they do. So is that for him? After Dull Chat, we'll see. No need for greed or hunger. Okay. A brotherhood of men. Oh, all the I see what they're doing with this. Okay, so I hate to pause it right there, but I just have to because I have to talk about what just happened there because it's just funny how right before that happened, I was talking about how this was a very appropriate song for them since they're being such a mixed group. And then that happens and it's just like, if anything, I almost feel like I need to thank them for reinforcing my point on you know them being such a mixed group now granted the one thing i don't uh, uh know is if um when you know they passed the card off you know and they held it there for a second like did that you know go with their identification too or was that just you know before they flipped it i don't know um personally i really don't care about that part you know that's just schematics you know but the fact you know that they're talking about so you got you know obviously somebody you know <clears throat> you know who's a you know gay Bi, trans, whatever it is, you know. Sorry, I, I, I always get the abbreviations wrong. I always get, I always miss one or two letters, so forgive me for that. Um, but then, you know, and then you're talking about, you know, like they're white, they're black, they're American, they're Jewish, they're Christian, Latina. I'm like, boom, right there. That is the whole essence of the song, right there. You got all these people where normally you might see them fighting against each other, but here they are together as one. And it's just like, if you knew nothing about them before then, you know that these guys are fantastic at what they do. And now it's just like, they're adding that little personal touch where it's like, you get to see them, you know, a little bit more, you know, and I'm not gonna lie, it really got me feeling a little bit emotional with that because it's just like seeing just the mix you know, and it's just like, uh, again, it's like, how could you find a song more appropriate than this for that mixture of people? It's such a beautiful thing. I really love what they did with that. That was so beautiful. I didn't pay attention to the timestamp. They must be getting close to the close on this one. You can tell they always just hit that intensity before they just drop it to a close. Mmm, good. You may oh. say I'm a dreamer. Oh, more cards? Okay. But I'm not the only one. I'm very curious to see what they do with this one. I hope someday. Join 
that, 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 that. If ever an exclamation point could ever have been put on an end of a song or a video, that was it. That was it. Oh, mm, mm, mm. I was talking about what they did earlier, you know, where they're just, you know, with each of their, you know, own personal identity. But then that last bit, that right there is what it's all about. No matter what it is you identify as, we are all still human beings. We all have the same blood running through our veins, you know, and whether our belief systems are different or whatnot, that does not lessen one's value as a human being. Not only did I really enjoy this video and this song, I really appreciated what they did with that and the fact that, you know, they made it so personal for each of them, you know, so it's like you understand, you know, who they, you know, what they identify as and everything like that. But at the same time, it's like, you know, while I know that about them, you know, that doesn't change anything about how I feel of them as people, as artists, as vocalists, whatever it is they do. If anything, I think this enhanced it, you know, because again, as I said before, the mix, you know, the way they are mixed, you know, and the fact that, you know, this is a song, again, talking about being as one, I'm like, this is such an appropriate song for them. And I just loved how, I mean, it's just like Barry Bonds could not have hit it out of the park any further than what these guys just did right there, you know. So I'm going to get off that soapbox. I'm going to go ahead and just end it right here. You know, I thank you all for stopping by. I hope you all enjoyed it. Um, if you haven't already, check out this playlist right over there. Um, it's going to have more of my uh, pentatonics reactions, and I will catch you all down the road.